Everyone's saying Levy out, Enoch out. Just remember, Brian Daigle and Stelios Triteos, we have been saying this for five years and we have been banging the drum. All the debates, all the arguments, everything. Look where we are now. So for me, absolutely, I'm happy because I've been saying this for so freaking long, Mari. I'm happy because the fan base has now woken up to it and they can see it for what it is. And all them protesters that got abused, that got memed, that had videos made about them, that had nothing but grief sent their way. Well, guess what? Those people that everyone called stupid, turns out they're the smartest people in the club because they were saying it for God knows how long. I pray to God tomorrow, the fan base sends a message like they've never sent before to Levy, to Enoch and this board. I hope they get the hell out of this club. I don't want them anywhere near this club. I can't stand what they've done to Tottenham. I can't stand what the club's become. become. I know this club going back 30 years, what it was like. The good, the bad and the ugly. But one thing we never did was lose our soul. Our soul has gone. They have torn the life out of Tottenham. There's no statues. There's no name of the stadium on the stadium. There's no um, remembrance of the glory years, of, of, of the glorious moments anywhere in the stadium. None of it. <clears throat> we, we, there's, there's, there's no recollection of our past. Why Tottenham was a big club. There's, there's, no, there's no history when you go to Tottenham anymore. And... They've diminished it. They've torn the life out of it. Never, never should red ever be allowed on the kit of Tottenham. We've accepted red now. We've accepted our arch rivals' colours on our kit. It's yeah. all these small things. It's unacceptable. And when you add it all up, it's no one. It's no wonder the team is shit. It's no wonder the team is crap, because the soul of the club has gone. Now, I hope fans voice their opinions tomorrow. If you go to Tottenham tomorrow, and you don't want to boycott you don't sorry you don't want to protest you don't want to get involved that's fine go and watch the game if you are going to protest if you are going to make noise make as much noise as possible and yes make it toxic let's make it toxic you can still support the team I'm going to cheer Tottenham if they score I'm going to sing come on you Spurs but I'm going to support my team but not the regime and the regime tomorrow they are going to get it not physically but they're going to get it verbally and it's going to be very loud in front of Sky Sports, in front of um, everyone watching uh, from, 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 from your TV sets, on the radio, or if you're there. I hope we get a big protest before the game. I hope we get an even bigger one inside the stadium. And God help them if we get spanked. That's all I'm going to say on it. Let's bring it. Well, let me show you guys something. 